training's never an expense. It's the investment in the future profitability of your department, right? Make sure you support the training back afterwards. Don't just because you got a guy two or three years in, he's trained. Experience means a lot too as you as you're going through that training path. Uh, you know, support it back on the floor. Um, that's what this that coaching and mentoring is all about. If you're a technician out there and you don't want to be obsolete in five years and you're not have not invested yourself into training now, you need to do it. You know, tomorrow. Go back to your shop tomorrow and say, hey. How can I get some training? You know, and if you're a shop owner and you're not offering training, uh, you know, why? Why aren't you? You know, because it, it, op it benefits the shop. It benefits everybody. Whether you're a technician or a shop owner, when there's a situation that you did it wrong, whether you didn't diagnose right, verify right, repair right, or you're an owner and your mechanic's making you mad because you can't ever do anything right, Ask yourself, how can I train to prevent this in the future? Training is the key of avoiding those frustrating situations that cause comebacks and misdiagnosis from both sides of the, of the street.